What are you doing here? Hippocrates sent me. Your commander stole his notes, and I think you have them. The ones written by the great Hippocrates himself. I'm sorry. They were burned in the last attack. What? You heard me. The medical tent was burned. At least I memorized the notes before we lost them. Now transcribe them when I have time, or when the war subsides. Then, you'll have to come with me. A patient Hippocrates is treating will die without your help. I have a patient right here who needs my help. Can't someone else take care of this one? I'm the only doctor here. Now let me work. You must work for Drachmi, just like everyone else. Whatever the commander is paying you, I'll pay you more. Then we leave. And let this person die. I could be convinced. On two conditions. Uh, out with it. I'll take double. A life's worth a lot. And for the sake of the gods, don't tell Hippocrates. You greedy, self-serving toad! Hippocrates only charges what his patients can afford. What makes you so special? He's a great man. But he's not the only one saving lives, Mystios. This is expensive work. Stand back and watch. There isn't enough time. I need you at Hippocrates' camp. Now. <laughs> Maybe the punch was a bit hasty, but I couldn't wait forever. Neither could Hippocrates. notes. I'm sorry. They were burnt when the fort was attacked. No! I tried to bring the fort's doctor, but he was killed before we could get here. That's awful. I'll have to do my best. He's dead. I wish I could have helped you more. I can't fault you for trying. Time to rack my brain and reconstruct those notes before another patient is lost. I'll go see the priests for more information about my mother. Come with me. You've had a busy day. The importance of diet to maintaining one's health cannot be overstated. What good can one apple really do? <laughs> well, taken daily, they can keep the doctor away. But two more serious matters. I know why you're here. You're looking for your mother. You remember her? I was young then. I didn't know how to help. I turned her away. But her look of determination and despair was born into my mind. It has never left me, and it never will. After, I swore to Apollo that I wouldn't turn away another patient. That I'd dedicate my life to the cause. She made an impression on me. Your brave mother did. She would be happy to know that. I sent your mother to the sanctuary of Asclepios. Tell the elder priest a treatment for the sacred disease will soon be available to any patient who needs it. Then he may talk to you. Thank you for everything, Hippocrates. I'll go see him now. 